What is good, guys? Dylan Merway here, and welcome back to NASCAR Rumble Part 3, ladies and gentlemen. Last part, we basically dominated ship shape. Today, we're going to be going out to uh, Southern Exposure, which is uh, Hillbilly County. So, what we're going to do... We're going to go in and pick our winning combination, which, by the way, are the Wallace brothers. I will be driving Kenny Wallace. Cannot say that without sounding like a pervert. And my teammate will be Rusty Wallace. We will be going down to Southern Exposure. Uh, just change our name to Dylan. So. Change name to our normal name today. Here's the kicker. We're going to be using manual transmission. At least I think I have it set on manual. Oh, go. Just a reminder that if you want to race on manual, since we promised that last week, um, to shift up is L2 and to shift down is L1. It's really simple. I don't race in manual that often, so it's going to be a pretty interesting challenge to see how, how it's going to work. As we basically just fly all the way to the lead, just clearing the other five guys who took the other lane. So Southern Exposure's got no of my several of my favorite tracks in this cup. Um, I believe Product Crossing you can get a gold wrench for that for racing there. And here's the reason I want to use manual. I totally averted that twister because I'm a boss. Is because of this. Oh, God. Maybe next lap. I'm getting assaulted. No, I wanted a wrench, but Steve, but Sterling Marlin molested me. That's what you get. We gotta win this. Our teammate Rusty Wallace leads, but we're Kenny Wallace. We're currently sucking ass right now. Not. Oh god, Steve Park, you ass white. Tony Stewart. Now Tony Stewart's trying to murder me, as we're all just booking it through the tunnel. Steve Park is bullying Rick Corelli. I'm gonna take out Sterling Marlin. And the Wallace boys are one, too. Duke's a hazard. Oh, somebody got hit. Somebody got hit with a freeze. Oh, what? <laughs> No, we just wanted a wrench. 
We just wanted that wrench. Now we got to win this. All right. So Rusty Wall still continues to lead the train. Sterling Marlin has the bullhorn. I swear if he knocks our teammate over, he's going to die. Rick Corelli is third. Tony Stewart is fourth. I tried fall slagging into fifth, like in my DMs, but I failed miserably. Look, Steve Park's got a little thing on the front of his car. Ah. Stuck that. Bro, I stuck that. Haha, <laughs> I lucked out. Stuart now takes the lead. <laughs> Come on. Hi, Tony. Hi, Tony. Tony Soprano. Oh, no. No, 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 no. Ha! Why didn't it hit Tony Stewart? Damn it. So the next track's got a few shortcuts that I love exploiting. Which I... Oh my god, Stewart. Okay. Rusty Wallace, you moron. Oh, stop murdering me, please. Apparently racing with manual is fucking impossible in this game. Uh, hey, somebody got hit. There's a few shortcuts in the next race that I will try to exploit once, uh, if I actually remember to shift manually. Which, by the way, are L1 and L2. L2 is to shift up, L1 is to shift down. As we're drifting this thing, try drifting this thing like a JDM car. Oh, oh. Wow, we missed that. We are invincible gods. We are gods. We just totally dodged two of those. We are number one. Oi. Oi. Oh, shit. We are number one. We. Wow. For once, our team actually finished one, too. It was actually kind of a close race. His textures are glitching like crazy. Textures are glitching on this game like crazy, man. Holy crap. So, me and Rusty Wallace have a 10-point lead over Tony Stewart and Steve Park. And Rick Corelli and Sterling Marlin are in third with five points. Crawdad Crossing, home to numerous shortcuts that I will gladly exploit. Yow. Hey, we didn't stall out. Shortcut exploit. Ah, damn. I was in. I should have stayed in the other lane. Should have stayed in the other lane. King of the road. Yep, I am the king of the road, motherfucker. Ah, jeez. Oh, I'm flying. I am flying. Here's shortcut number one. That I gladly exploit, and that I love to use. I can actually get to 40 second leads on this track, provided I don't get a gas lowering power up. King of the hill. 
See previous statement. Hey, oh god. Oh my god. Uh, uh, no. Ouch. Well, there's shortcuts I like to exploit, provided I can drive through them. So, lap one is in the books. We keep a consistent five second lead over uh, Sterling Marlin, while well, it's down to six seconds. Dick. Wow, with automatic transmission, I could actually. Oh my god! Two storms! Wee! Okay, Sterling Marlin, your turn to die. Alright, Sterling Marlin, it's your turn to die. Freeze! Everybody clap your hands. Come on, y'all. Driving across the damn train track because I'm a boss. I'm a boss. I'm a boss. I'm a ball fucking boss. Ouch. Double ouch. Triple ouch. Quadruple ouch. We're currently got a four second lead and there's a twister coming up behind us. Please, God, don't hit us. Ah, bloody. Dug out. Hey, the government can kiss my. F Big government can kiss my fat butt. Caused Rick Corelli to flip over, and we weren't even going. Oh my God, are you kidding me? And we weren't even going full speed yet, and we caused Rick Corelli to do a barrel roll. Bitch. Alright, seven second lead over what well, nine ten seconds now over Sterling Marlin and Rick Corelli. And that just uh, evaporated with that one twister. By the way, just judging how crazy and how shitty I am driving with a stick in this game, I'm gonna go back to automatic for beach blast. Um, ouch. Okay, we can stop. Oh, Jesus. Sterl Marlin is literally the devil in this cup. Oh, Sterling Marlin. I got a power up and a front bumper for you. Damn. Oh god. That that ain't right, y'all. No, go. Go. Well, Steve Park just glitched through the wall. Just cause, you know, logic. Huh, uh, oh wow, all over the top of Rusty Wallace, my man. My man, nigga. 
All the way to first. And we are gone. Make good use out of that. Alright. Second place is three seconds back, and that is uh, Rick Corelli. Dick. Come on, win this thing. Must win. We must win. Rick Corelli and Rusty Wallace continue to fight. Rusty Wallace just dropped to fourth. And he just finished. Tony Stewart is just came in last. Sorry, I just got something on my phone before I the recording. Hey, stop bullying me, Steve Park. Finally, can actually get a chance to exploit some really good shortcuts here, making this track really, really easy. I would all oh, let's see, Wallace, you stupid dick. Steve Park is drawn. We got drunk NASCAR drivers over here, guys. We just killed the violinist. And <laughs> notice how this track is shaped just like a pig. <laughs> Right now we're driving on its back. Oh god. I think I killed Tony Stewart. I killed the killer. Up to third, now I gotta take out C Park, who's drifting backwards. Rusty Wallace is leading, C, or, I'm sorry, Rick Corelli is second, and we just slid into third, while we just took second. Yeah. Alright, move over, Rusty. Underappreciated Wallace driver coming to the lead. Lap two. Driving up. Oh. All right. Let's see what unlockables we'll get at the end of this cup. Ouch. Well, we killed the violinist. Painfully killed the violinist in this track. Just slid to the lead, and we're gonna pull, try to pull away at least. Hey, grippy tires. All right. So we're seven point, almost eight seconds ahead of uh, Rick Corelli in second. Yes. Damn. All 
Okay, Rusty Wallace is done molesting me. This isn't the South. You're not my mother. Rusty Wallace is done molesting me. This isn't the South. You're not my mother. Rusty Wallace, this isn't the deep south. You are not my mother. Go to Hooters and work. Alright, let's go. See if we can kill the other hillbilly pigs in this race. I mean, Christ, we already killed, killed the Viola on the first lap. I mean, we basically ran his ass right over. All right. We got a shield. Wait for somebody to use it. This is the equivalent of in Mario Kart having a star and somebody behind you has a blue shell. Just wait for them to use it. Wait for somebody. Somebody throw a twister at me. Ass wipes. There we go. Wait for it. Ha <laughs> ha. Piss. Well, hey, at least we can freeze this time. Driving along, bopping in the shit. Well, last lap, we just dropped a third. Running to Rick Ferrelli, flip him a little bit. It is super ineffective. He runs in the gas. It's super effective. Why? Yes, sir. It's kids. Oh, wow. Well, the twister shook everything up. Hi, Tony Stewart. Oh, you li Oh, okay. Well, we're going to probably lose this race, thanks to Tony Stewart. In his uh, shockwave he gave us. Where's the freeze coming from, guys? Okay, y'all. Somebody, Rusty Wallace, do your job and take out Rick Corelli. Damn it. Boy. Okay, we're going back to automatic next cop. Let's see how championship shakes out. Oh my god, we dominated. <laughs> so, me and Rusty Wallace both have 46 points. Second place, Rick Corelli has... Uh, Rick Corelli and Sterling Marlin both have 33 points. And Tony Stewart and Steve Park both have 14 And we got Road to Ruin. We can race against David Pearson. We unlock the chicken truck. And that is it for NASCAR Rumble. If you guys like this video, make sure to click the like button, click the comments button, give us some comments, click that subscribe button, follow me on social media. And you guys know the drill. Hope you guys have a good day.